So I want to talk to you about fixing your homeschooler's math struggle or problem. I guess I should start by telling you that I'm an English literature major <laughs> and a writer. My name is Dr. Fred Ray Librand, but I've also spent a lot of time with math and uh, have a bit of a knack for it and certainly a love and interest in it. And as we homeschooled our five kids, some did better than others. But all did fine. The two that didn't were the ones who sort of cheated and had to go back and start over. And I want to tell you, they did fine. In fact, uh, they did plenty fine in life. Here's how we did it. And if you and all homeschoolers would do these simple things, you'd see everything change. So what do you do? Well, the first thing you want to understand is where your child is in math. So if they've missed some key concepts, you need to back them up or do some extra work because math builds progressively. You know that. But here's the maybe more important thing. Every day, by the way, <laughs> I need you to be willing to do this. Okay, you don't have to do it. You don't have to commit to it. But are you willing? Are you willing to try what I'm about to say? How however landish it is because you can do it. But... I want you to get willingness in your head. And it works like this. Every day, a child should make 100 on their math homework. I'm not talking about their test, on their math homework. Every day, they should make 100. Now, how in the world could you make that happen? It's really simple. You let them do their homework. You grade it. You find out what they missed. And you had them redo those problems until they're all done correctly and you grade them. That out amounts to a 100. Maybe not on the first try, but overall. Now for us, we had a standard that our kids needed to make a 90 on the first time through their homework every day. If they dropped below that and were consistently over a week or two making an 80 or 70, we would reduce the number of problems so we could get the challenge to match their skill level. And as they got faster and faster, this is in about a two-hour period of math uh, every day, as they got faster and faster, we might raise their problems. So we're adjusting to make sure the challenge is good. But if your children are not getting 100 every day by the end of the day from what they did and then what they corrected, they're never going to learn math. If they do, it's going to be very, very sloppy and painful. This is transformational. Get your child to make 100 every day, and his or her confidence will grow. Understanding of math, math is the language of science, language of logic. You're going to get a lot of benefits. They get to understand absolutes, right and wrong, uh, come out of a study of math. So plenty of fun stuff going on there. Plus, long term, they'll be able to check a bill at a restaurant. Take care.